Greetings, minions, mech warriors, and fellow gamers. This is Silverblade playing Battletech, episode 67. Well, last episode we were there and we're now here after going someplace else in between. <laughs> I'll let that sink in for a minute. Uh, anyways, uh, <laughs> we're trying to get our funds up. Uh, to get some really good stuff. Um, so let's go back in on the contracts. Let's see, a lot of these are pretty simple ones, but I have to keep away from fighting pirates. So that's a, a good paying one. That's a better paying one. So it's an outright battle in Martian atmosphere. Let's do we all right so I think we'll trade behemoth for Medusa and see if he's got the chops to be a better gunner uh, quite like Silverblade he, he's he's actually got a pretty good track record with the headshots not a perfect batting average but Better than Behemoth and her drunk ass. I don't have a problem with people drinking, but when it's affecting your responsibilities and your work performance, then I'm going to have a problem with it. <laughs> and clearly, she isn't firing at her best. I think we had one headshot from her in the last game, and in other games, I think she's been just, she's just been letting me down. It's like, come on, girl. Don't leave me hanging like that. You gotta go for the head. You like head. <clears throat> I'm just gonna shut up right now. So we got a hot shot out here. Got a hot shot out here, thinks he's top shit. And I kind of reject that notion. Not that I'm top shit but I got the better mechs so screw him okay let me fight boss It's not going to give me a line of sight here, so might as well move very fast, or fast as an atlas can go anyways. Uh, there we go. It'll be a bullet sponge for a turn. Okay, so we'll position the missile mechs behind this rock here and well, let loose.
Okay, he softened up pretty good. Damn right he did. Now let's get up here. I can't hit anything, so... Take the high ground. dealing with here. Come on, let me play. <laughs> I couldn't hit the broadside of an atlas. <laughs> Neither could that guy with the PPC, anyway. Yeah, missiles, you can hit anything with missiles. If you can't hit anything with a laser, then your, your marksmanship should be called into question. Medusa, you're gonna have to uh, prove your worth. Oh, radiation field. Well, shit. Um, let's see how good you are of a shot. Okay, you need either practice or um, to get replaced. Commando, Phoenix Hawk. I like that. How some fired straight and some arced. That, that looked pretty damn cool. Okay, so this guy is hurt. We'll stay here and snipe this guy. Wow. Okay, I missed like two big shots missed, but that last one made it worth it. Oh shit. Let's move his big ass over this way. And take the little dude out. <laughs> Alright. Medusa's kind of earning his keep now. I think he had to adjust from going from a missile mech 
to a heavy sn sniper type of mech. Those were some solid hits. I mean, when you think about it, the guy had two uh, chevrons for evasion. He's a small mech, and I was able to shoot him out of his cockpit, so that is all good. That guy and that guy and hmm. I'll go for this guy. He's gonna be knocked down. A head injury and a knockdown. So weak. Alright, let's see. We'll leave him on the ground and take out this guy, if we can. Sweet. So that's getting a little old. All right, Medusa. Now there's nowhere I can go. It's not gonna get him jacked up in some way. So I guess I'll go here. <laughs> He's an ace. There we go. So we cleared the the flank. So now every almost everything should be in front of us now. So we'll get the get my guys to cover the Atlas, who's starting to get a little bit squishy in the armor. And these guys are solid, so might as well. Ooh wee! Oh, there's a hundred tonner out there. Oh man, I, would, I don't care what it is, I want it. <laughs> oh yeah. That's the stuff. Okay, let's get some movement here. Oh, what is that? A rifleman. Okay, let's shoot him out of the cockpit. Weapon accuracy of seven. Haha. <laughs> Head destroyed. Goodbye. 
So now it's just me and the big guy out here. And these, this other team, we're the professionals. They're the backup. <laughs> King Crab. Okay. I think I can shoot this guy out of the cockpit. I think. If anything, we're, we're gonna make him hurt, so let's go for it. Okay, so we scrambled him, scrambled him up a bit. And I can't, I don't want to cross the radiation field. So we can make him do that, actually. No. Acknowledge. Go like that and just pepper him. If anything, we can get a head hit and soften up that head a bit. Um, so that my gosses can really punch through. <laughs> I got another crab. I got crabs. <sighs> Mission successful. Who's the professionals now? Bitch. <laughs> and it's like what? Three headshots right there? Maybe four? Let's see, uh, there's a griffin, there's a commando, so that's two, the king crab is three, rifleman is four, spider is five, wow, okay, um, let's see, don't see any special gear, so yeah, we're going for the crab. Do we get here? Yeah, nothing special. But that king crab, man. Hell yeah. But what I really want is probably another annihilator. Damn straight it is, but we're going to put it in the mech bay, or in the uh, storage mech of the mech bay, because, well, let's take a look at it, so, in the arms you have space for uh, two support and two ballistic, the AC-20 is good there, ultra AC-20 is even better. Um, I put Gauss rifles on this thing, but I think they're better suited to an Annihilator. So yeah, Ultra AC-20, pow, pow. Um, you got four missile mounts. This is why I have a, a missile mech that's a, a King Crab. And then you have four in one spot for, for the lasers. So this is better off as a ballistic short-range uh, mech in, th in that configuration as opposed to um, you know missile mech or laser mech just because it's all in one side and that kind of makes it not all that great y you kind of want the 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 number of slots you can allocate to this or this or that spread out instead of fixated him on one side but we'll we'll keep it we'll keep it all right I think we have time for another mission why not um, okay that's pirate that's Torian it's another battle 
So let's let's do eat. So yeah, Medusa's turning out to be a so far a pretty good sniper. And we could turn that king, the other king crab, into a, a missile crab, and drop the um, the Highlander. But we'll keep keep with it as is for right now. I think the Highlander is going to be the uh, speediest one because it's it's li slightly lighter than than the others. up and kill 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 moving to position Got it. good job uh, can't do anything about the radiation, so it's one of the reasons why I hate Martian maps. So where's he? he's there? I don't see any escape side, so I'll move it up here. Okay. This could be painful. See one and not the other. That's irritating. All right. It looks like they're at least that vehicle was carrying infernos, and that is not exactly nice. Uh, reserve. Sheesh, that has to die. A violent death. Uh oh, that one's gonna shred my shit. Good to go. If I don't know anything about it anyway. Let's see if this does something about it. Oh, so close. Oof. Minimal damage on that. Had some some spread on that. Not nice. Hopefully the whirlwind will protect me. Come on. Let's unleash hell. There we go. Did not want that thing to strike again. If that thing was closer when it when it fired, it would have done some serious damage. As it was, I think only like two or three shots actually made it through, but ugh. See in infernos. It's like napalm missiles, and you don't want those in a Martian environment. It's just nah, naughty. One for the scrappy. Ooh, 
damn. Gonna soften him up. And then I squish. Actually, no. Oh. Step back. Just blow him away. Hopefully. There we go. All right, no more vehicles, please. All right, a light mech, a very light mech. So that's probably like a flea. By. Where was that? Spray? Ooh, wow. Okay. Position confirmed. Yep, it's a flea. Uh, he ain't going nowhere fast. So he's a sitting duck right now. Uh, Alright, that's good enough, I guess. Nice! Targets are at here, but we'll run up to here. All right, there's a target over there. Cataphract, huh? Nice miss, buddy. Waiting for orders. Heading out. All right, so let's. Hose him down. Yes, Commander. On my way. Uh, goody. All right, let's soften him up a little bit more. Uh, yeah, do arcing fire. Snipe him. Woo! And disarmed and knocked down. Teamwork. Teamwork. <laughs> Got it in the head, so that was a pretty good called shot. Actually, we're going to reserve. And we'll do another headshot again. No matter what, I'm going to be cracking this sucker, so. Yes! Head destroyed! That's all of them. Mission successful. All right, Groovy. So, out of all that, we're probably going to, I mean, we're likely to get the cataphract. Uh, so, I only need two parts for that. Let's see. much else to get so I guess it won't, won't hurt to get all of it yeah it only leaves a flea behind and yeah cool 
I mean, it's not a big, big deal, but yeah, nice little target practice. Alright, let's uh, store him and and let's see. Pirate, pirate, directorate, pirate. Pirates. There's only one mission left. And then we need to go find another another place to play. And we'll do that in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, see you later. Twitch. Twitch.